Beamers presents the bloopers. <laughs> okay. Beep. Ah, so Buki. 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 So BQ Gourmet refers to B grade class. <laughs> class. Beep. B class, it's a grade. Uh, I quit. Okay. Beep. So BQ Gourmet refers to, I'm so sad. <laughs> it's so sad for me. I just it's wanted raining. to go home. I know some people don't like pork, and those people are what we refer to as crazy. No, that's just... <laughs> you can't say that. <laughs> now I know some people don't like pork, but have you tried pork? Pork is so good. Honestly. Bacon. I mean... The knives that they gave you here, by the way. Let me just say this. Okay. <laughs> Basically, this is Japanese pan fried pork chop. But what makes this place particularly great is that they actually sous vide their. sous vide? Sous vide? Sous vide? V I D E. Sous vide? Okay. Yeah. What? It's what? miserable. Huh? What? <laughs> ton teki is actually compounded two different words. Ton is like don for, not ton. Ton teki is actually compounded. <laughs> Shit <laughs> I'm losing my shit, man. I'm losing my shit. Okay. High class restaurants are nice and all, but eating there every day, just not doable. Unless you're a billionaire, which most of us are. And if you're watching our videos, <laughs> if you're watching our videos as a billionaire, hey. I'd like you to sponsor me so that I can eat at Coco Curry every day. <laughs> I'd have an investment opportunity for you. <laughs> Do you know Coco Curry? <laughs> Heads up about the knives they give you here. You'd be lucky if you could cut butter with these knives. <laughs> They're pretty. I think so many people eat here that these knives have become. You can't sharpen a serrated as blade. As sharp as spoons. All right, these knives are so frustrating. He's just hungry. He gets cranky when he's hungry. He's like, I want to put it in my mouth now, and I can't. So I feel sad. The trick when it comes to eating tonteki is you're supposed to cut it up in as many pieces as you can mm -hmm. at the beginning, and then just shovel it in your mouth afterwards. Ah, uh, I see. No cutting between. Cutting first, shoveling and then you're done. Um, in between that, Simon didn't mention chewing. That's okay. He just has actually a gizzard built into his neck. Uh, most humans don't, but Simon does. So he puts food in his mouth and then he eats it like a duck. He just goes like... And then it um, it gets ground up in his neck. Like, that's how birds eat. So Grind up in your neck, girl. Oh, boy. <laughs> how has this come up twice in a video? This definitely came up twice in a video. Set myself up for that again. And this is where Dan lets us know if me saying grind up in your neck is appropriate or inappropriate for a YouTube video. Audience will let you. Guess what? I'm leaving it in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're leaving it in this time. Now, when it comes to BQ Gourmet, the chefs working here aren't famous chefs in the A class restaurants. So, a lot of these people depend on food reviews in order to get publicity. Mm -hmm. And there are a couple different apps and a bunch of different websites mm. dedicated to the BQ Gourmet movements. It's just really gross to hear Simon sucking on his pork fat while I'm trying to. Mm. Pork fat, bitch. Mm. I'm sorry, vegetarians, but I love meat. <laughs> Maybe pray for Fool's Day, we'll do a video talking about going vegan. <laughs> mm, I'm so sorry. But I'm not sorry. 